So hey everybody, I am excited to introduce you to one of my newest Dolly friends, an incredibly talented doll collector and artist, um, Araceli, which I hope I am saying that right. I've been practicing all day. Um, so yep. nice, to, thank you. Yeah, thanks for being here. And Araceli is the owner of a shop with the coolest name. I've been saying it for 20 minutes, Poof Chibi Doll Planet. Yep, that's right. I need to know what Poof Chibi Doll Planet is. So that would probably be my first question, but I will want to ask you kind of what you're selling and you know what you're, how you got into this. But first, what is Poof Chibi Doll Planet? Uh, so Poof Chibi Doll Planet is actually the sister shop of my um, digital art shop. So my digital art shop is Poof Chibi Planet. Um, and Poof was literally um, me being a really short person uh, when I started collecting and just being an anime otaku because that's how I first started um it was literally just I wanted something exciting something that really grabbed people so poof, and then you see so my logo has literally it's a chibi of me pooping up on a little planet I just thought it was really catchy I wanted something that would grab people and fun to say um yeah. so that's cool and, so so this is the sister company how did so you got into dolls I mean obviously I'm like I'm creeping behind you there so you decided to move kind of more specifically into doll things or like doll accessories with this yeah I wanted yeah sorry I, yeah I wanted this sister shop to yeah to be specifically for dolls um I guess I wanted to marry the two because again like I said I started as a visual artist um, and drawing chibis and digital art, stuff like that. Um, and that's still what I'm going to offer in my shop. Mm -hmm. But I also like to do crochet, and I also like collecting dolls. So, it, yeah, it's literally just trying to marry all of my um, hobbies together. Okay, that's awesome. So how long have you been collecting dolls? It's been a while. Okay. Um, I got a, a bee goth doll. Mm -hmm. uh, I would say about 15 years ago from friends and then I started researching where that doll came from and then I slowly started gathering a bunch of other dolls uh, and eventually I got my first pull-up which was the Tokidoki Luna pull-up and I found that yeah. on the Tokidoki yeah. website yeah and then I started researching where she came from and <laughs> And then you Here fell into today. a dark hole of, yes, I know, we've all been there. Yeah. We all have that same story. Um, so what, you mentioned crocheting and stuff, but what type of items are you going to feature in Poof Chibi Doll Planet? I'm going to just keep right. saying it. <laughs> Thank you, yes. So in Poof Chibi Doll Planet, um, I'm mostly going to be selling cute little panties and bloomers. Um, so I've got about two, so it's going to be two sizes. I'm offering them for dolls and pull-ups. Oh, um, and then it'll be in two styles. So there's like the bikini style. I'll actually show it on the dolls itself. Mm -hmm. There's a bikini style, so it's just a little bit tighter on the hips. Mm -hmm. And then there's the boy short style, which is just a little thicker on the hips. Oh my gosh. Um, How long do those take, if I can ask? Uh, I got it down to about 30 minutes. It really? used to take me an hour. Yeah, oh it used to take me an hour, and now it's thirty minutes. Um, and I've also got it down to so at the shops they sell them. So they'll sell like the cotton thread, and then I'm able to make about like three quarters of it for a dowel. Um, yeah, and it's taking me about thirty minutes to get a panty okay. done. But still, I mean, that's wonderful. And and you mentioned your art too. So part of Poof Chibi Doll Planet is stickers or buttons or can, do you have any of that? I just want to. <laughs> yeah, sorry. So I wish I had some buttons. I, I did try to prepare. Uh, I do have, I will be offering buttons and I'll be offering prints. So last year for Puddle, I did some art for them. So yeah. these are the steampunk dolls. Uh, that group did. So I'm offering two prints. Awesome. Sorry. So. Yeah. Okay. So I saw that on. Yeah. I actually, yeah, I clicked on your Deviant Art um, link, uh, the artist thing, and I actually, I think I saw the the steampunk pieces. Yay! I'm so glad those are going to be available. I want. Yeah, yeah. One. You need to put uh, Zappa on there. Zappa. 
yeah, yeah. Um, she'll be ready inside for October because um, she's absolutely fabulous. I'm so glad they did another steampunk. Um, so yeah, so I'll be offering those, and I'll be offering those also in button form. So in button form, it's going to be each individual doll in chibi form on okay. a button. Um, and I'm, they'll also be offered in bookmarks as well. Um, okay. And I linked the Deviant Art page because, like I said earlier, I'm an anime otaku fan originally. Yeah. So there's a lot of Sailor Moon fan art. There's some Monster High and Ever After High art out there. Um, yeah. And some older stuff as well. So if people wanted to check out, those prints will also be available on that day. So tell me about your art background are you you actually went to school is this something that you studied or is it something self-taught well it's a bit of both I did actually did go to school I did so after high school I did a portfolio course at the central technical school in Toronto oh okay um so I did a portfolio certificate year and I fleshed out so I did fine art traditional art and then also digital art um and digital art is just what's readily available, but by yeah. trade, I'm actually a painter. Oh, okay. So, so, you, yeah, so that's your day job. <laughs> that's yeah, awesome. Yeah, basically. Okay, so what's next for you is you're launching imminently. And I think by yeah. the time this actually airs, you will your page will be up. And the best way for people to get a hold of you to buy from you is through Facebook. That is correct? Yeah, that's right. So the proof should be planet. Doll, sorry, the Poof Tribute Doll Planet page is up and running and it's going to be, yes, it's going to be up and running. So what people can do is they'll either PM me and say, hey, I'd like to buy panty and this size and this yeah. color. And I'll have pictures up and everything to let everybody know what sizes and what's available. Yeah. Um, most of what will be featured is going to be available. Some of it I am going to be offering commission as well if people wanted right. a particular style or yeah. a different size. Yeah, I could see little bloomers. Are those, so behind you, are those actually dolls in the little crochet panties? Yes, that's can right. I, can, I, can I see yeah. them? Yeah, so I've got a semi-customized white witch, and she is in the bikini style. Okay. And then beside her, it's actually oh. cinnamon roll. Also okay. the bikini style. And the stripes. Um, so cute. Yeah, it is a stripe. Yep. I hopefully I thought the stripes were really cute, so I'm trying to get a lot of those done. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then I've got a view here. She's actually on an obitsu body. So the whole oh, tie so cool. fits it pretty well. It's a little tight, so I'll probably have to make it a little looser. Okay. But it's a pretty good fit actually. Oh my gosh, that is and so then, cool. Thank you. Look at Ryan. and I call her Nana. Yeah, okay. that's right. But I call her Nana because she looks so much like um, from that manga, Nana. Um, that was done a few years back. You're right. And she's actually in the, yeah, and she's actually in the thicker bloomer. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to turn her around. So if somebody wanted, okay. um, you know, a custom size, like for instance, somebody wants a made to move Barbie, would you be... I mean, do you, you did say you take commissions, like you might do something that's a little bit different or do you need to stick to kind of those two right now? So I can, I can do a commission depending on if I actually have a doll. Uh, so, so unfortunately, I'm not a smart doll collector yet. So I won't be able to offer that. Um, but yeah, we'll be able to offer Barbie or Monster High or Never After High. I'll put up a list. Okay. Um, oh, good, good. For good. what I can offer in terms of commissions. Yeah. Oh my gosh, and that's then, so cute. Thank you. It's on the and end then, there. Look at last you. one. Sorry, yeah. Trying to get. So cute. She's another Buell. Thank you. And she is wearing uh, also a bloomer style. Sorry. So cute. I love the pink. Aww. Thank, so thank cute. you. Thank you. Awesome. All right. Well, listen, thank you um, so much for sharing this um, with thank us. You. I've actually, I'd love to know more about poof chibi planet you know because i love all cute things anyway and i love chibis so um people can get a hold of you on your facebook page i know you're going to be launching some stuff so we'll see more pictures um anything else that we should know uh, sorry yeah i can't believe i blanked out i'm also going to be doing um witch hat fasteners um what they're also in crochet 
Yeah, because it's October is coming up and Halloween is coming up. I'm like, okay, this is a good time to launch my yes. little witch hat. So they will also come in the various sizes, and so I'll have them up as well. And I say fasteners because in order to get them on the head, you need to like have them on a clip or a pin. Um, gotcha. And those look really small for that giganto head. Are I mean, are they? How do they look? Are the, what what when you held up the little black one? What size is that for? I'm so the black that. one, oh, okay. So the black one is definitely going to be for a pull up. Rita will just model for me. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. And then the smaller one. And then the smaller one will definitely be for the doll. <gasps> that is so cute. Thank you. And so those are going to be available immediately. Are you going to continue to have them or are they just kind of an October fun thing? Um, It'd be fun to do seasonal stuff, just saying. You know what? Yeah, I think it's seasonal. Um, but because I also do a bit of the golf thing, we'll see how it goes. But I do like the idea of it being a seasonal item and then me switching it up to a different fastener um, yeah. for okay. the rest of the time. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Well, listen, thank you. It was so good to actually finally talk to you instead of just seeing like, you know, your posts on Facebook. Same and here. I recommend everybody check out, I'm sorry, Poof Chibi Doll Planet, the Doll best Planet. name ever um, on you. Facebook. I'll put the uh, link in the description and we will talk soon. Yay. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah.